is going on YouTube? It's Brian Will Lifty here back with another video and we have a big leg session in store with my boy Oscar. Shout out to him for recording the Steve Will Do It video. And thanks to you guys because we're only rising up from here. Like I'm really, really thankful for like everyone that's like been around me and supporting me. And like these past few videos I've gotten like hella views, like at least for my standards, because I just started out like literally like a month ago. And yeah, we're gonna do a comment of the day and it's gonna be by the boy Clark. That's like the one of the biggest guys that I know. He said, he said um, vlogs keep getting better and better. And it's because you guys are the ones motivating me to keep doing these videos and all the support and love I get from you guys. So yeah, let's get this leg session going. No, but this shit right here, when I do it, it's crooked as fuck. So this shit crooked, so look. I'm fucking leaning this way to, to get both of the legs. That shit go crazy. It ain't fucking easy, bro. Look at the sweat. Oh my god. All in today. All in or nothing, bro. That's it. It's one of those days where you feel great, you do great, and you fucking look great, bro. All right, let's run it. Let's run it. We only keep going up from here, bro. We got some hamstring extensions on the way up, regular, and then on the way down, very slow control and negative. At least 12 with relatively heavy weight. Let's run it. Ready. fucking done dude I can barely touch my toes I mean well I can but that's not that's not the point but like now we're gonna do some he thought we we're probably gonna do some squats on a certain machine we're actually gonna lunge did I surprise you or what I surprised you, I I surprise you. I you. let's run it up baby let's go Cardio circuit. 40 minutes, bro, after an hour of leg day. Shit, not easy, man, but we grind it. Time to record my friends that finally showed up when I am done. I, I did uh, two sets of five pull ups and look how much I'm sweating. Alright, now it's your daily dose of roasting Valerio time. What are those? Oh my god, bro. Come on, bro, work those calves, dog. What's wrong with you? record much when I was training but hey I finished so now I could fuck around and fuck around with this guy even more bro go for it bro yeah, that's all you got only two plates for now catch up catch up bro damn damn four hub four hub intro right here What is up guys, Brian will lift it back with another video and we are going to discuss our fitness journeys, how we started and how it's going and how our goals change throughout the years. So just really quickly, cause I don't want to make this too long. We started, well I started uh, being athletic, like being like involved like, in all the sports when I was like six. Cause of my mom, like she put me like in basketball, swimming and like 
you name it, like all the sports, like you name it. And I stuck to swimming. I did it from when I was like eight to eighteen. So I had like a like a basis, like a fun, like a fundamental aspect of uh, of training because it was like cardio and intense cardio. Like he can tell you ten year over ten years of swimming, like it takes a toll on your body. But he did it for the better. And then long story short, FIU doesn't have a swim team, and I kind of lost the passion for it. And I transitioned into Jimmy when I got into FIU because I had like so much time in between my classes, and I was like, might as well. So, you know, like a basic gym, bro, like I started doing arms every day and that's basically like all I did. But then I realized there was like so much more to it and my goals changed. Like I was like, oh, I want to be the biggest guy in the gym. But like that is not the case. Like I had the, I like went through my phase of ego lifting and I'm really, really glad that I did not get hurt during that because people would be getting hurt and they're out for months. But yeah, I'm glad I got over that phase. And my goals right now, I'm just trying to be more functional. I'm trying to, like, I've been getting into calisthenic work, just mobility work with him, trying to get better and better. I'm going to get into meditation and just stuff like that. I just want to work on my physical as well as my mental health. So if you have anything to add on to that. Yeah, just like Brian, um, I started out with swimming, athletic background, tried a bunch of different sports. And so I always had a training background and I had the discipline to to actually like put myself mm. through hard sets and, and go every day because mentality even, yeah. yeah mental toughness yeah yes, like, sir, even yes, on days sir. that I didn't want to go like I, we would go because we were used to that yeah keep in mind swimming at least three times a week double session so you could literally spend uh, dry land like that's like cardio work uh, and swim plus the swimming portion like five hours a day so just keep that in mind it's yeah, a lot it's, it's a lot of, it's a yeah. lot of stuff and so like you, you kind of like you kind of become numb to uh long training sessions and and just going to the gym every day and it becomes that like what we do now is so much easier it, it, yeah. and it's like like yeah. i have so much fun at the gym like it's not even like yeah it's a passion at this point like i first started out like something like i'm interested in now it's just like i feel empty without it man like it's just my safe place i you could probably feel the same way telling the same thing yeah i mean um and obviously like like our goals have changed uh we we have technically just started our fitness journeys because it's only been what like four years five years at this point yeah that's technically uh, for a lot of people that's a long time but technically some people be doing this over 30 years and some people just be like going to the gym like even when they're 70s so huge prop to them i look up to those uh, i look up to those people they're grinding keep on pushing bro you know yeah like and that's kind of like I mean, I, I don't know about you, but I, I personally want to be someone that's going to be like functional for my entire life. Like, I want to be able to like, exactly. like play with, exactly. my, like, like play sports with my kids, like, like, um, and I don't know, just be able to like do stuff until like I'm I'm old. And, yeah. And I never want to. I never want to be like in pain or constantly. I mean, I've I've already done that, been through that, and it sucks. So I just want to be long. Yeah. So then I completely restructured my training and I became uh, extremely flexible. I, I, I structured my my warm-ups. My warm-ups are extremely long. Ask anyone who works out with me, they're definitely, they get annoyed by how long I warm up for. Yeah, at first I thought there was like no point, but like being with you more, like I see there's, there's a point to it. Like we have to have longevity. Like we are, we are here for a good time, but like we also have to be there for a long time. Like, you know, I'm trying, like how you said, like I'm trying to like spend time with kids, bro. Like when I'm like 50 and 60, like I want to be able to do stuff that most people can't, you know. So natural is the way to go. Natural is definitely natural the way to go. is the way to go because you know, long and healthier life. Like there's no unless you're doing competition. Like there's really like no point being like the most jacked one there. Like what? Like for ego, people give you compliments here and there. So they even like stare at you weird. So like, yeah, just trying to be more functional. Like that's my goal at the end of the day, at least for now. And I want to keep it that way too. I guess you could say the same. And I can promise you that, like, no girl is impressed if you look like a fucking gorilla. Yeah. They honestly just be more impressed with dad bodies nowadays. And, like, a so, girl like, is definitely more impressed with a split than, than, like, if you look like a gorilla. Yeah. Wait, at the end of the day, your body is just a little ass that you work on. The most important thing is your mind, your mental health. All right, guys? What do you mean, asset? Your asset. Well, <laughs> that's what we're talking about, girls. But 
yeah we don't really want to make this video like too long anymore you guys but yeah that's just our fitness journey like how we started how we got in how we got into fitness and like how our goals have changed but yeah anything to add before um well also we've changed our nutrition throughout this entire oh thing. yeah for sure that that's like already a given um we went through a phase well me i went through a phase drinking hella alcohol and then i took a whole 180 no alcohol whatsoever there's no need for alcohol i'm not saying you like you drink a glass of wine that's going to be like that <coughs> detrimental to your health but just don't consistently be drinking and try to be consistent with your diet like the same way like oh if you eat one bad meal it's not going to affect you but like the same way like oh one bad meal is not going to like kill your gains but at the same time you have to be like more consistent with it like you have to uh, can't be eating all that junk food like every time and then the same thing like if you eat unhealthy like and you eat like one healthy meal that's not going to do anything to you it's all about consistency at the end of the day yeah and i mean definitely like experimenting with your body is my recommendation like like constantly trying out new things constantly like fine because like we're young we we have no fucking clue like we've got a long time with like our yes we've sir. got time to go so we have to start like playing like doing all that shit now to figure out like what's gonna work for us in the future so like yeah so like my recommendation to people starting out don't mess with supplements yet don't don't get used to like the whey protein powders none of that like completely like get your nutrition right first and then worry about all that exactly because you have to experiment with yourself like you said like one thing that works for him may not work for me and vice versa so it's just like about trial and error but just like be smart along the journey right don't let like social media like influence you like oh this guy is so big dude it's just an illusion bro at the end of the day they pick best lighting angles editing you name it like it's just like i said it's an illusion man just uh just get one percent better each day like the only competition that you guys have is yourself so and look like even though even though there's a lot of people you can look up to there's a lot of people whose advice you can follow like even us too like mm -hmm. there's yeah. there's a lot of people we can look up to there's a lot of people that like that like when they look at us or like or for example and again sometimes like people will like fangirl over like like our physiques and stuff or like or like how we can like train so hard and it's like like yes we can do that but there's a reason we can do that there's a reason why like that's like we've we've been able to put in the work we've, we've done this because exactly, of consistency exactly. like taking care of our bodies making sure that we're doing this like and, and we're not we're not just doing it we're not just doing it because we want to look good we're doing it because it's something that we enjoy and if, if you're just going to the gym for ego reasons or for ego purposes it, it's it's gonna come crashing down on you and you're not exactly. gonna enjoy it as much and 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 honestly like the people that go for ego reasons are the ones that go for two months and then stop going so it's yeah. it, it's something that like obviously it's going to suck in the beginning but you have to like embrace it as a lifestyle exactly i mean i don't have anything to add you said it best yourself man um thank you guys for listening like comment and subscribe if you don't like the video well let us know the reason why you don't like it maybe i could improve but yeah that's just our story and peace out guys see you guys on the next one